Hey guys, so, hi, hello, welcome, konnichiwa, hallo, to my German friends. Alright, so I'm 100% doing this episode because of a comment someone made on one of my videos. Now that comment was that I had installed these rotors backwards. It kind of blew my mind because I had research the six ways to Sunday to make sure I did it right. But I thought, you know what, let's take the wheel off, let's take a look at it, make sure I did it the right way. Because nobody wants a rotor that doesn't cool efficiently. So that's what we're doing today. Now I will tell you, spoiler alert, I installed them the right way. They are correct. Let me show you how you know. Okay, because you might have a brake job coming up, you might be installing your own rotors, and you're probably thinking to yourself right now, Black Flag, how do I know if I'm installing my rotors the right way? I didn't know there was two ways to install them. Or a myriad of other questions, guys. But Black Flag is here for you. We're going to help you. I'm going to show you how to know. Because knowing is half the battle. The more you know... Let's do it. So my rotors look like horse poop right now because of my track day. Don't let that get in your way. They just don't look brand new anymore. You ready? I wish they were shiny. I wish they were clean. But they're not. I'm going to show you anyway because I trust you. So you might be thinking, those are ugly. Kind of are. Next up, how to clean your rotors. But not right now. The direction of these holes and slots have nothing to do with if a rotor is installed correctly or incorrectly. It's all about the internal veins. Now it's a little hard to see here, but these veins are going to the back of the car. And that's how you want it. Maybe you can see better as I rotate the rotor. So the only way to really know if a rotor is on properly has to do with the internal veins on the inside of the rotor. The internal veins should lean to the back of the car. The direction of the slots or the drill holes on the face of the rotor has nothing to do with the proper orientation of a rotor. That's it. Pay attention to the internal cooling veins. That's it, homies. Lesson's over. Something to pay attention to. My rotors, the slots and holes are facing forward, forward rotation, but the internal veins are facing back. So, most likely where this comment came from was a different brand. So, different brands of rotors might have the slots or the holes facing the same direction as the internal veins, but not this one. So don't judge a book by its cover. Good lesson. Pay attention to the inside. It's what's on the inside that counts, guys. Not the outside. We want the outside to look good. But it's all about what's on the inside. Because if the outside looks good and the inside sucks, It's a waste. So, that's the lesson on how to install rotors properly. It's the direction of the internal veins, plain and simple. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, and we'll see you soon.